Hi, I'm Shari with Karma Kids Yoga, and this is a kids yoga class in support of the Goats of Anarchy. Goats of Anarchy is one of my favorite organizations to support. Leanne and her staff do such incredible work for so many animals, not just goats. And they do this every single day without fail. My heart explodes just keeping uh, track of all the work that they're doing. It's just been unbelievable. So I'm so grateful to be part of this. Let's get started. Let's all sit crisscross applesauce. Have your hands. Let's put them together and rub, rub, rub them and feel them get toasty warm. And check them on your cheeks. Oh, are they getting warmer? Good, then we're ready to sing our own song. So if you know it, sing it with me. If you don't, you'll learn it so quickly, I promise. Rub your hands, sit up tall, take a deep breath. Om. Nice, do you have your feet? Let's try rubbing our feet. Can you do it? It might be a little tricky, but let's try it. Rub your feet, sit up tall, take a deep breath. Om. Yay! Clap, clap, clap your feet, clap your feet together. Clap, clap, clap your feet, clap your feet together. You know, I can hardly hear it when I just clap my feet. Let's add in our hands. Clap, clap, hands and feet, hands and feet together. Clap, clap, hands and feet, hands and feet together. Now let's reach everything up to the sky and say hooray. Hugging your knees, give them both a kiss. Now let's reach everything up to the sky again, and this time we'll say, woohoo! And give your knees another kiss. Love you, knees. Now, let's stretch out our legs really wide and our arms super wide, too. We're gonna go from side to side, but not before I put on my favorite clock song. All right, everybody, let's wind up our yoga clock. Stretch, stretch out, out your, your legs, legs really wide. Stretch out your arms really, really, really wide. And we're gonna go side, side to, side. to side. Here we go. Tick tock, little yoga clock. 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 And freeze. And freeze. Oh. Everybody, okay, on your toes, wipe them up. Toes. Ooh, that tickles. And your knees, wind them up too. Maybe give them a kiss. Everybody wind up your belly buttons. Belly buttons. <laughs> oh, it tickles. And wind up your nose. Get your nose. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, we're gonna go again. Okay, we're gonna go faster. Let's take Stretch a breath so we're ready. Arms. Really, really nice. Here we go, faster. Super fast. Mine's red. 
We're gonna hold on to the handlebars and we're gonna lean on one foot. Use your other foot to scoot. Here we go. Scoot, 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 glide. Let's try it on the other side. Scoot, 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 glide. Change legs again. Scoot, 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 glide. One more should get us there. Here we go. Scoot, 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 glide. And we made it. Let's put our scooter aside. It's a beautiful day. The sun is shining. Let's smell that fresh farm air. <sighs> now, there's so many creatures here at the farm. I'm not sure who to visit first. But whenever I travel, I love to sing songs about the places that I go. Does anyone know any songs about a farm? Good one. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a, oh, who's that? Nay, a horse, E-I-E-I-O. With a nay here and a nay there. Here at nay, there at nay, everywhere at nay. Well, obviously we're gonna need to do horse pose. So let's start in the downward dog. Take one leg to the sky, really stretch out that hoof, and say, nay. Try the other hoof, nay. And the first one, nay. And the other one, nay. Come on down and shake out your front hooves. Would you guys like a horse pose challenge? Excellent horse pose challenge, should you choose to accept it. Horses like to kick sometimes. So, let's come into our horse pose again. That leg that's on the floor, can you give it a little kick? Kick, kick. Be sure to land on your feet. Try the other leg. Kick, kick, kick. And let out one more big neigh for our horse friend. And I'm gonna give him an apple, because he loves it very much and we'll say goodbye. Bye, horse. Nay. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a, who's that? A pig, E-I-E-I-O, with an oink, oink here and a there, here an oink, there an oink, everywhere. Well, we're gonna need to be pigs. I love piggies so much. They love to roll in the mud. So let's hug in our piggy knees and find the muddiest mud puddle and rock yourself from side to side. Oink, 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 oink. Oh, it feels so good on my back. Let me hear your pig sounds. Oink, oink, oink. Oink, oink, oink. And like most creatures that are hungry in the morning, I'm gonna give him a piggy snack. Oh, and if you're still covered in mud, let's shake it all off. Woo! But you know what? I love mud. Let's jump right back in. Okay! Right back in that mud puddle. Rock yourself from side to side. Oink, oink, oink. Oink, 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 oink. Amazing pigs. Shake off that muddy mud one more time. Woo! And let's say goodbye to the pig. Adios. Oh, he's bilingual. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a, who's that guy? Oh, you're right, a cow. With a moo moo here and a mer there. Here, mer, there, mer, everywhere, moo. Well, of course. We should be cows right away. Let's put our hands and knees on the floor. Hands and knees on the floor. Look up to the sky, take a big cow breath in and say, Ooh. Let's do it again and see if we can move for longer. Take a bigger cow breath in. hungry, maybe eat some grass. Mm. 
when your cow belly's full. Let's take one last big cow breath in and let out the biggest moo of the day. Moo. Amazing. Let's say goodbye to the cow, but not before giving him a little breakfast treat. Mmm, cow snacks. Mmm. All right, ciao, cow. Bye. Well, McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a quack, 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 quack. Who's this cutie? Quack, quack. A duck with a quack, quack here and a quack, quack there. Here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack, 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 quack. Well, we need to be ducks, of course, so let's squat down low. Whoops, bring your hands to your shoulders to make your duck wings. We'll waddle and say, quack, 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 quack. Now, if you happen to be with someone right now, maybe give them a duck wing high five. Quack, 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 quack. Oh, the cutest little ducks ever. Of course, I'm gonna give the duck some duck snacks too. Quack, quack, quack. What's that? Quack, 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 quack. I'd like to see your duck pose one more time. Let's squat down low. Bring your hands to your shoulders again to make your duck wings and say quack, 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 quack. Good job, ducks. Let's say goodbye to the sweet little duck. Quack, quack. Oh, duck kisses. Bye, cutie duck. Well, McDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a, who's that? A bunny with a, uh-oh, what does the bunny say? I just don't know. But do you know how the bunny gets around? Does he ride a scooter? Go in a stroller? He hops. So let's come up to Stan and see these things here. What are these? Oh, they're Bunny's cute little floppy ears. We're going to make those floppy ears by bringing our arms to our head. Oh, look at my big floppy ears. And as we said, the bunny likes to hop. So let's bend our knees and we'll hop. Boing, 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 freeze. Oh, shake your bunny tail. And hop. Boing, 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 freeze. And shake your bunny tail one more time. Now, bunny would love to teach you a bunny breath. Is that okay? This is bunny's nose. Where's your nose? Here's my nose. Can you take three little bunny breaths in? One, two, three. Un, deux, trois. Un, dos, tres. Through the nose. And out. Three breaths in. And one out. Take a regular breath in. Notice how you feel. Bunny breath is fun and energizing. One more regular breath, sweet bunny. I'm gonna give bunny a little carrot. Oh, and maybe a piece of lettuce too. Well earned. Bye, sweet bunny. Ciao, ciao. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a woof, 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 <laughs> woof. Oh, Lucy, that's so many kisses. Oh, dog slobber. I love it. Ah, uh, farmer's dog. Well, we're going to need to come into down dog. Down dog. And if your doggie's happy today, wag your tail. If you're happy and you know it, wag your tail. If you're happy and you know it, wag your tail. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, wag your tail. Woof, woof, woof. <laughs> woof. Nice down dogs. 
I'm gonna, of course, give Lucy a snack too. She looks out for everyone on the farm. I'm gonna give her an extra treat. Woof, 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 woof. <laughs> woof. Let's come into Down Dog one more time. Down Dog. Woof, woof, woof. Can I hear your dog sounds? <laughs> woof. Ah, Downward Dog is such a great pose for the whole body. Now, there's also things growing everywhere on the farm. They're tall, they have trunks and branches. Um, some animals might, some creatures might live in there. The birds stop by, there's leaves. Do you know what they are? There's some trees on the farm. So let's stand really tall and imagine that there's roots coming out of the bottom of your feet going deep into the ground. Let's reach our tree branches up to the sky. Maybe you have a lot of branches, maybe you just want one or two. Up to you. When you're ready, we're gonna pick up one leg for tree pose. And think about what kind of tree you'd like to be. An apple tree, a cherry tree, a pancake tree, or a teddy bear tree. So many choices. And then come on down and give your legs a little shake or roo. And in yoga, what we do on one side, we must do on the other side. So let's root our feet back into the ground. Tree branches up. And when you're ready, we're gonna pick up the other leg for tree pose. Think about what it might be like to be a tree standing outside in the winter, in the spring, the summer, the fall, through all kinds of weather, like rain and snow and fog, and also all the little creatures that might live there in the tree. And come on down and give your body a little shake, shake. Now there's also stuff growing all over the farm. They come in the spring, they're everywhere now they are. They smell delightful, the bumblebees love them, the bees love them. What are they? They smell so good. Flowers. Let's smell. Would you like to smell my flower? What do you think it smells like? Mmm, cantaloupe? Try this one. Ah, grapes? No. Peats? I'm not sure. Try this one. Ah. Ah. Let's come into flower pose. We can make a flower with our body. Sit with your feet together so your toes are kissing and your heels are kissing too. And then from here, we're gonna pick up those feet. Oh, that's tricky. Can you do it? And we'll put them down for a moment. Pick them up, put them down, pick them up. This time, let's put our hands into the bowl it makes and under for flower pose. Smell your flower. Oh my goodness, mine smells like chocolate. What does your flower smell like? And now let's imagine that the sun is going down and our flower is closing and taking a little rest. And slowly come on up. Let's do our flower one more time. So feet together so your toes are kissing. Lift them up, hands in the middle and under. Amazing, let's smell our flower one last time. And come on out and give your legs a shake, shake. Now, as I said, there's creatures that love the flowers. Do you remember who they are? A butterfly, that's right. My friend Lulu would never miss the opportunity to do butterfly pose or sing the butterfly song. Hello, Lulu. Here's a little nectar for you. Lulu is a baby butterfly. She loves books and friends and going on the swings at the park. Yeah. Bloop, bloop. So we're gonna sit with our feet together so our toes are kissing and our heels are kissing too for butterfly pose. You can flutter your wings, make antennas, and think about what color butterfly you are today. I think today I would like to be purple and orange. 
Yeah. All right, can you show me how you take your butterfly nose down to your butterfly toes? Now it's your toes. And come up. Can you bring your butterfly toes up to your nose? I don't know. Why don't we try? And the other side. Beep, 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 beep. Let's stretch out a wing. Zoop. And bring it back. And the other wing. Zoop. And back. Let's try both wings. Oh my goodness, it might be really tricky. But if you hold it for one second, that's amazing. Let's use our arm wings too to flutter. Good job, butterflies. Now, we're gonna say goodbye to Lulu. Bye, Lulu. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for being a butterfly with me. Now there's one other very important creature, and that is our goat. Now, not all, but some goats have their, um, their horns, their antlers. I'm not exactly sure. We're gonna make those on our arms like this, and we're gonna come up on our knees and say, ma, and then come down. And again, ma, and up, ma. One more time, ma. And did you know that that's called bleating? Can I hear your bleats again? Make your Bring your arms up to your ears, make your little horns. Come on up, big goat breath in. And this time when you come down, let's take a little rest in mouse pose. And mouse pose is the smallest of all poses. It's a resting pose. So staying on your knees, make a little ball with your body. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak. And come on up and just take a moment to check in and notice how you feel right now. Now, it has come time for our relaxation, but we're not taking a nap. No, 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 please don't fall asleep. That would be so silly. We're just resting our bodies because we did so many tricky things and this is just part of our class. We're gonna chill. We're gonna breathe. If you have a stuffed animal you'd like to lie down with, go right ahead. I'm gonna put on some relaxing music. And this song is called Just Be by Kira Willie. Come lay down. Ah, relax your feet.
once you're seated, take another big breath in. <sighs> Let's bring our hands to our heart. Let's send some love out to our friends at Ghosts of Anarchy and to anyone that might need it. Take a big breath in. Blow some love in your hands and send it out. Now let's reach up to the sky and give it a really big tickle, 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 tickle clap. And bring your hands down in front of your heart and take a moment to thank yourself and honor yourself for having a healthy body, a strong body, a kind body, and a brave body. And at the end of yoga, there's a very special word that we say, and that word is namaste. Can you say that? Namaste. And that means the light inside of me sees the light and the goodness and the kindness inside of each of you. And we're gonna sing a song to close our class. If you know it, sing it with me. If you don't, you'll learn it so quickly. My little light falls to your little light, your little light your little light my little light falls to your little light namaste namaste everyone thank you so much uh, for joining me today please help support the goats of anarchy their work is incredible thank you so much namaste